So we have our Easy ABL sensor here. We're going to go ahead and take the bottom nut off the sensor. And you're going to want to thread the top one up a little over halfway. Now I'm installing this on a CR10 V2 and this is the OEM bracket that we designed for the CR10 V2. Most of your brackets will need additional screws. If you have a screw assortment, they can be really handy. Most of the mounts use an M3 by eight millimeter screw. And in this case, we're gonna go ahead and put the screws into the mount and then screw them into the two bolts here. Now, every printer has a different way of mounting the sensor to the actual printer. So I'm gonna go ahead and attach the sensor mount to the printer's carriage. And you wanna make sure that the screws are fully seated and the bracket should be pretty sturdy once it's on there. Now we're gonna go ahead and take the sensor and set it into the mount. And as you can see here, the sensor is hanging down quite a bit. So we want to go ahead and move this top nut here down a little bit because eventually we want to have the sensor two millimeters higher than our nozzle. There is a calibration screw on the side of the sensor. So make sure that you have the adjustment screw in a position where you can easily get to it once we do the calibration. So go ahead and put the bottom nut on and just snug it up. We are going to come back and readjust this. We're just getting a rough installation done so we can route the cable. 